Are you looking for the ideal travel guitar? Something that you can take anywhere, make sure that it fits on the overhead uh, bin of an airline and is practically indestructible? Well, we have one for you. Stick around, stay tuned. We're gonna put it through all of its paces and tell you all about it. Watching Alamo Music TV. My name is Chris McKee with Alamo Music Center in San Antonio, Texas. You can find us online at alamomusic.com. If you are new here, make sure that you subscribe, turn on notifications, and like our video so you are notified as soon as we put a new one out. In this episode, we're taking a look at this carbon fiber, very unique travel guitar from Journey Instruments. This is the overhead guitar, the OF660M. Now, we have discussed the overhead guitars before in past videos, specifically talking about travel guitars. I'll put a link to that one just up on the top if you'd like to take a look at that. But prior to this one, most of the ones that we focused on were their wooden models with either rosewood, ovuncle, mahogany, what have you, and spruce tops. This carbon fiber of 660 model is unique. It gives you some uh, kind of insurance, if you will, when it comes to traveling. But let's, before we get into that, talk about what's unique about these guitars, period. It looks different, and, uh, and I will admit to that right off the bat, but it is built around purpose. So the first thing that you should know about this guitar is it has a unique patented neck joint. If you look here, there's a button, and if you look on the back, there's this wheel here. Now what this wheel does is basically just act as some security for the neck. If I take it and loosen it there, right? Righty tighty, lefty loosey for those watching at home. I'm going to support the guitar with, against the tension of the strings and push this button down. That releases the neck mechanism on the guitar. Actually, I still have it locked. There we go. And then it completely folds off. Now the guitar comes with a bag, a square bag that is uniquely made for this guitar, a compartment for the neck to go into, a place for the strings to go over, and a compartment for the body, along with additional pockets so you can fit things like your laptop in. In fact, if you haven't gotten it yet, this is specifically made for air travel. That's why it's called, dun dun dun, dun the overhead guitar. So let's re-secure it, and it's really this simple. So you put it in this pocket that's reinforced here for the neck and then push back and it's locked. I can let go of it right there. By depressing it against this spring-loaded button, the neck snaps in place. But you don't want it to accidentally come undone, particularly while you're playing it. So you take and you tighten that back knob just to further secure the neck in place. And then that's it. There you have it. Tune it up and you're ready to go. In fact, it might already be tuned for you once you put it in place, depending upon things with the strings. It's got some unique aspects to it, like this uh, retention uh, bit uh, just on the other side of the nut. This ensures that the neck or the strings are not flopping all over the place when it's detached from the body. It really keeps them where they need to be, ensuring that as you put it back on, it's coming through the nut slots correctly. It has some quality uh, tuners on it from Grover. It is a very small body, but it is a full 24 and a half inch scale. Now let's stop and talk about how important that is. If you travel a lot and you are wanting to play guitar and take it with you, when you have a travel guitar, most of the time you are dealing with a shorter scale guitar. So if you look at something like a Baby Taylor, a Little Martin, or the GS Mini, which is arguably the most popular travel guitar that's on the market, those are shorter than full size scale lengths. This, however, at 24 and a half inches is a full scale length guitar. And that means that the spacing on the frets is full scale spacing. So if you didn't understand before, understand now. When you go to a shorter scale, as the scale gets shorter, all those frets get a little bit closer together. The downside to that is that if you are practicing on a short scale guitar for any really discernible period of time and that's all you're playing, you are going to feel the stretch when you go to a full size guitar and you're going to have to adjust accordingly. So, nice benefit of this is that you don't have to deal with that. Let's talk about the body. 
It's all carbon fiber. So the nice thing about this body on this particular model is it's darn near indestructible and it's not going to change with temperature and humidity and pressure changes. So going up in the plane, coming down, going from one climate to another climate, it's going to be okay through all of that. Um, you know, it's not going to swell up on you, it's not going to crack on you, and it's darn near indestructible. It's carbon fiber. It's got a unique shape to it and some special bracing that's built into the guitar in order to help it resonate with a full sound despite the small size. And you have this molded in uh, carve right here, which is nice. It's not a full cutaway, but it gives you access with the palm of your hand coming up here to the higher frets. And then this oblong kind of half tier shaped um, sound hole really projects a lot of sound. You've got a pickup system in it. You got your uh, input jack right there on the end and integrated into your strap button and a nice belly carve here on the back. All in all, really a compelling instrument for the weary road worn traveler that just wants to keep playing guitar. That's really all we want. We want to be able to fly and keep playing guitar no matter what without having to go to a music shop and hope there's something playable when we get there. So. That's the features of this unique guitar. We're gonna put it through its paces so that you can hear that it really has a pretty phenomenal sound despite its size. Check it out. So there you have it. This is the Journey Overhead OF660M. Now this is matte black, but it's available in a bunch of different uh, finishes. So you can get something in a nice fetching blue or a, a radical red, or I, I'm just kidding. But yeah, it comes in different colors. Um, and it's available from Aloe Music. So if you'd like more information about these guitars, uh, click on the link below. That'll take you to our website and see what we have in stock or what's available to order. And we will get one into your hot little hand so that the next plane trip that you take, you'll be able to take your peanuts. Uh, no, they don't serve those anymore because people have allergies. Uh, I guess it's uh, pretzels. 
and your uh, laptop or iPad and your guitar so that when you get to your destination, you will be able to play it. Please, please, please don't take this out in the middle of a flight because you'll just end up on a cell phone video on Facebook uh, with uh, an airline flight attendant yelling at you and, and all of us laughing. So if you're new to the channel, make sure that you subscribe, turn on notifications, like our videos and comment below. We'd like to hear more from you and keep you watching. But remember, whether it's your full-size guitar or some travel buddy that you have with you when you are on the road, the best guitar is the one you're making music on. So keep it up. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Hey, thanks so much for watching. We hope you are enjoying our channel. You might be interested to know that Alamo Music has two more YouTube channels. One for piano and keyboard enthusiasts, and the other, our Alamo Music Audio Lab channel that focuses on synthesizers, drum machines, and other things with Chris Klein. So, if you are interested in checking those out, down in the bottom of the description, I have links to both of those channels. We hope to see you there as well.